on the phone, surfing the net, watching TV, playing a video game with an iPod stuck in your ear. Researchers call it media multitasking. It even happens in places you'd never suspect. We actually were in Africa uh, about a month ago doing a show on the global water crisis in this village where no one had access to basic water, and yet virtually every child in this village had a cell phone. The Kaiser Family Foundation reports 65 percent of the time kids say they're doing homework on the computer. They're also listening to music, watching TV, surfing the web, checking email or instant messaging their friends. But surprisingly, not when they're tuned in to their favorite TV program. It turns out that a majority of the time that kids are watching TV, they're not doing anything else. This explosion of new media has sparked debate on what all these gadgets may be doing to the teenage brain. It's quite likely that they're not going to have a lot of pause time to deliberate about the work they're doing. So where's the cost there? It's in deep thinking. It's in being thoughtful about what you're doing. But MTV's Ian Rowe calls multitasking a speeding train that's left the station. Kids are already doing it. The challenge, he says, is using multimedia to reach them with important messages like fitness, anti-smoking, and HIV prevention.